<laughs> Melody. Yo, I love Wujin's rapping, bro. I swear. <laughs> Every single time. <laughs> All right, hi, hello everyone. Look, child, you see the title, you see what we're here to do. We are here for another first listen, this time to AB6's Born Like This. Um, I really need to look at the lyrics to like all of these tracks, bruh. Like with an album title like that and whatnot. Oh my goodness, and then my boy Dehui is on the production and on the credits as he normally is nowadays at least. Side note, this is, uh, I'm so sorry, we're going on a tangent. The What's that producer show that he was on? I might react to that on Patreon someday. If you know the scoop on that, let me know because I've always been vaguely like interested in that anyways point is we're gonna go through the rest of the b-sides already did the title track and like the title track wish it were longer but what can you do <laughs> this is where we're gonna go through the rest of the b-sides and have a vibe let's start with in my vein okay. so I was born. <laughs> so, that's that's so terrible that started off so different than the title track. Okay, fair enough. <sighs> Love the ambient sound of the crowd, the people. Melody. Uh, melody. All these bugs. You mean to tell me this wasn't the title track? The guitar on the brass. <sighs> what did I say? What did I say? What did I say in my reaction to their title track? Their voices are perfect for this old school genre type of music, bro. They think. I ain't about to give a soul for this. Chords. Hey, love. You hear that flute like sent to the back? Harmony. Delicious. The bass. Of course, bro. Mass. Yo! Yeah, the vocals! The delivery! The 
the base is moving. <laughs> Give AB6 a tiny dust concert immediately. And he's going on its life with this one. Oh! Come on! Come on, Motel! Time to live me the screen! <laughs> Vocals. We're gonna skip naked. Since there's already reaction to that. It'll be the video right before this. From the channel. Who <laughs> oh, got beatboxing lured into? That's crazy. That's the. You mean to tell me in my veins what's at the title track? Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. I still like Naked, but that hit different, that hit different, that hit different. Oh my goodness. What? Oh! Oh! Love the guitar. I love how this song started. Give us these vocals. Ooh. Love the synths. I like these chords in the chorus. The delivery. The harmonies. If you like the song, you probably like Memories by Rise. <laughs> Add that. Add that. This is a very SM coded song, I love it. Oh. Mm -hmm. With the vocals in the background. I love choruses like this. This tempo. The vocal lyric on the chorus. Press <laughs> Those crashes. Very 90s this part. Very old school. Oh. Yo, if you like the song, you would really like Memories by Rise, bruh. Had to hit us with the R&B bridge too, just because they could. They hit us with the soul. No, this is okay. We gotta catch up. This might be my favorite so far. There's a joke I always like to make. 
but it's actually not an appropriate joke. <laughs> if you really think about it. Piano chords. The piano chords are really working for me the year, this year, in songs. Yes, the harmonies, the adverbs. Go on. Vocals. Vocals. The stadium. This is a song for a stadium. The, the flow of these songs is very kind of seamless. I I know I added that to my like songs immediately, but it's, it's I can already tell I like it. Yes. Love the use of guitar in the album. I knew this would be a kind of culture beat. Skipping Mobaton? <laughs> Maybe that guitar? It's a vibe. I love it. Mm -hmm. Great vocals in the background. The boy groups are really killing it with the vocal layering this year. Vocals. My third gen heart is singing. So it's like we got voice shots in the back too. Yo, I love Wujin's rapping, bro. I swear. <laughs> Every single time. This, this instrumentation. Love the grittiness of the synths in the background. The texture of them. That's so cute, bruh. Love the harmonies, bruh. I love how it goes into the chorus as well. Oh. Oh. The bass, voice. Mm. Oh. We love a great at the moment. Mm. <laughs> it's still going. Vibes. If they promote a V side, I hope they promote that one. I went to adjust my glasses, but I always forget that I don't have them on because of the glare. Again with the piano chords. So good. Mm. Melodies too. Mm -hmm. 
vocals. Ooh. The breath of this in the stone. Mm. <laughs> it's giving drum and bass. Kind of liquid drum and bass, specifically. I think we have strings. Oh, these melodies, bro. I'm the big fan of that. My boy! <laughs> he might be my vice, you know? I've never chosen a bias for AB6. Even though I've followed them since their debut, damn near. Strings. Oh, it's at the end. Love that melody. This is Duke Get Out with Forever. Forever Young is my favorite. Uh -huh. This is kind of epic too. It could be on a movie soundtrack. This one might actually be my favorite. What a vibe. It's that last melody of the chorus though. Give us the twinklies. Love it when you can hear the fingers sliding on the strings of the electric guitar. Love it when you can hear that. Did I say acoustic guitar? I think that was an electric guitar. A pause. That's a bop. A love answer. <laughs> but this ain't about you, girl. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was fun. That was fun. You know, I'm glad I did this. I'm really glad I did this because I didn't have plans to do this um, EP today. In fact, I quite literally just squeezed it in once I realized because I didn't know this was, uh, I didn't know whether Naked was going to be a single or whether it's going to be the title track off an EP or whatnot. But I'm really glad I did this because I'm a big fan of these B-sides. In fact, <laughs> I think I like every single B-side more than I like the title track, which is, which sounds bad to say. Like, because I like the title track. I just want a bit more from the title track. Did you see my reaction? You understand? Um, but I just want a bit more from the title track. And I feel like I got the more that I wanted from the B-sides here. Like, I'm very glad I did this. Like, and naturally, all of the B-sides are over three minutes. But <laughs> it's actually not that egregious for AB6 to have, like, sub three minute songs honestly because there's only four members it gets really egregious to me when there's like six or more members and you're giving them two minutes and some change songs i just think but it's really fine for naked to be like two minutes and 41 seconds i'm just just for the genre of song it is and whatnot i'm just particular i just need to be a little bit longer but nonetheless, it's still going to be on the playlist. You see, I added it to my like songs. I'm still going to listen to it, but... <laughs> I'm still going to listen to it, but... It could have been a bit longer. And this is why all of these songs ha gave me an experience. Full self-contained experiences while still flowing well. Um, 
throughout the album. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. AB6, they're always really solid. I always really enjoy them. Um, if I were to try and rank these... Butterfly Effect. I really like the string breakdown of Butterfly Effect. But I really like the beginning of Forever Young at the bridge. I'm going to try and rank them. My number one is Forever Young. My number two is Butterfly Effect. My number three is In My Vein. My number four is Hurt Me and my number five is Naked. Yeah. But it's all a no skip. I like them all. AB6. They really never let me down, honestly, truly. But what I was going to ask earlier is if they had any recent variety content. Because maybe, I feel like I said this last time too. But if they have any recent variety content, let me know and I'll start pulling it on Patreon. Because for as long as I've known about this group and known the members, I really don't know that much about them. Like I know, I feel like I know the most about Dehui because I have seen a variety content in which he appears solo. And I've seen, um... Oong, um, in kind of like the context of build up, but I don't know. <laughs> and I feel like I've seen clips of Ujin and um, Donghyun around, so I'm not 100% unfamiliar with them and their variety content, but like I am mostly unfamiliar with it. And I should change that, anyways. Let me know your thoughts down below if you made it this far. Thank you so much for dealing with me. Whatever this was over AB6. Like, comment, subscribe, so choose. Uh, let me know your favorite track, your ranking, whatever you want to let me know. I'll read it. <laughs> I promise. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Oh, no, wait. <laughs>